Okay, hello, welcome back to the next episode of Amnesia the Bunker. It's just... Ugh, words don't describe this game for me. Um, but yeah, last episode we did bits in maintenance. We managed to do all those rooms. The chapel turns out to be the nest of this monster, where he's hung bodies up. Like, lovely, morbid decor. Um, we managed to get to the pillbox. We then managed to get three different codes for lockers. So I think we've done all the lockers now, potentially. And we got the wrench, and then we got the chain, the bolt cutters. Now, the bolt cutters would allow me access to something in Reynard's room, so that's going to be the first place I go to. But then after that, we're going to... I've done the prison as well. I don't know why it's not revealed itself. Um... Whether I have to click the map or what, I don't know, but I'm just going to ignore that for now because the one circled, our soldiers' quarters and arsenal. So, we're going to do those next. But yeah, if you are enjoying this video, then please like it. Subscribe if you're new. And just let me in the... Just, just give me words of encouragement, please, in the comments, because it's just awful. It really is just the most awful thing. So we're going with the bolt cutters to rain our dream. And then I think we are fully done with... Is that the monster? I fucking... I really hope it wasn't, because it kind of looked like him, you know? Literature. Oh, okay, from Renoir, Renoir, Renoir to Reynard. My friend, received your message about the order to dig the bunker deeper. I appreciate your enthusiasm, your patriotism. I only wish I could share it. I fear command will only prove themselves fools and your men will pay the cost. They want a grand subterranean hub of courage, steel, and intelligence. We both know what they will get. A rancid, stinking pit. A void, a hole, full of men, scared and confused. Then they'll proclaim it a success and issue a new order. Dig again. Deeper this time. For France. For victory. Your orders. That dig. They are the very war itself in miniature. The arrogant and idiotic leading the scared and foolish ever downward towards darkness. I'm sorry, my friend. My mood is pitch black. And everywhere I look I see this world barreling forward into chaos. Please keep this message between us. I don't need a court-martial heaped upon my woes. And then from Delphi to Renard. In regards the fate of the saboteur Toussaint Beaufoy, LaRue has added further details to his confession. He now claims that upon entering the Roman tunnels that night, Toussaint confided in LaRue that he had other work to do. When LaRue pressed him for detail, Toussaint whispered something and pointed to his own eyes. Soon after, Toussaint split from the other saboteurs and disappeared into the darkness. When the others failed to locate him, they assumed he had returned to his bunk and proceeded with their plan. I believe it's safe to assume that Toussaint either perished in the blast or has since starved to death in the rubble. Is that it? That's it. Okay, so a bit more lore. I like me some lore. get that locked, and that saved. And let me just delay for a little bit longer by turning that off. Um, okay. Got that away. And that away. So, yeah, with that being said then, why is it got a circle at the exit? So the notes help me pinpoint to what my circled objectives are. So yeah, um, to any of my men who see this, once we're free of this place, I will get the arsenal code from him. I will get it and I will radio it back to you. Trapped down here with that beast, the arsenal may be your only hope. It's all I can do, all I have courage to do. Get to the communications room in the soldiers' quarters. 
hide there, I'll broadcast the code. Communications room in the soldiers' quarters. That's there. So that'll give us the arsenal code, and I'm assuming we'll need the arsenal code to get, like, the dynamite. So that's that note. And then this one. Um, yeah, the dynamite is locked in the arsenal. The detonator handle is somewhere down in the Roman tunnels. What does that mean, then? Where the fuck are the Roman tunnels? We don't know. However, we are brave adventurers. I'm going to take a flare for the rats. I don't really know why I need the lighter, so I'm going to leave the lighter there. I'm going to have a med kit, just in case. Um, I think that's it. I think that's it. So let me... Oh, what should we do first, then? We're going to do the soldiers' quarters, right? Before we do the arsenal, because we need the code. That much is obvious. Alright, wish me luck. We are edging closer to ending this hell. Soldiers' quarters and communications. Whoa, lag. Alright, what are we saying? Okay, so we've got some fuel and we've got a rag. I'll take them until I don't need them. Damn. Okay, that would have been handy. Do I grenade it? Is there a table that I can hide? Probs not. And there's a hole right there, so that seems like suicide. Why is there no power here? That's locked. And that's locked. There's no power down here. That needs a key. Oh, we're not doing well. Lovely. How about now? Awful. What is that bedroom? Okay, rats. That'll be for the rats. What is a stick for? Can I... Can I inquire about what the stick's for? A piece of wood. Requires further casting. Uh, c casting? That's not fucking D&D, &D, mate. What if I put the cloth on the stick? Torch. I put the lighter away, didn't I? Fuck you. All right, we'll just take the fuel. But that's interesting to know. So I'll take another fuel and a photo. Oh, when they were happy and jovial, and there's a grate there that I can use my wrench on. So there's nothing else in here. Securitar. Everything's locked, man. Something's been drawn into my map, though. Why are there so many tripwires? Why is everyone trying to... Let me use my flare to get rid of these bloody rats. Some more. Finally got some answers from the engineering team. Command believes there are old Roman tunnels adjacent to our position. They're opening them this evening. Command hopes to use them to launch a surprise attack. As if any attack at this point could be termed surprise. This is a war. We are always expecting an attack. Curious to see these tunnels, though. A little dash of antiquity would leave, like, would leave, and, would leave and up the police. It certainly helped keep my mind off the daily grind of the war. That was the 30th of April. 9th of May. The officers presented me today with rather unexpected and strange gift. Aging text from inside the Roman tunnels. Seems they got word of my interest. 
I took them, of course, but the truth is these texts are va far too fragile, too valuable to survive life in this horrid place. They require more delicate hands, more learned minds than mine. Still, curiosity reigns. Lenthame. This morning, Ackerman died of his wounds. I'd only known him a time, but considered him one of my better friends here. I hope heaven welcomes him. To distract myself, I've been going over the text and have had quite the shock. These texts are not Roman in origin. The language is Latin, or Latinate at least, but what they're writing about has no relation to what I know of Roman culture from any era. The text seems to be of a religious or at least superstitious nature. A phrase is repeated, to cross into the darkness beyond, and then something about sight. And that soldier pointed at his eyes, didn't he, when he mur murmured, and then the other one ran away. 13th of May. Haven't slept, need to get this down. The texts are of a religious nature. Whoever these ancient people were, they believed that they had found a means to immortality. And to achieve this goal, they needed access to what they thought was some other world. One dominated by darkness and ruled by... I don't know, they use words I can't translate, ruled by something. They claim that darkness... That dark other, they claim that dark other world was full of spirits, monsters, and that the air there was endlessly alive with cries of torment and the sickly rattle of souls near death. That is what they were using the tunnels for. For them, it was a doorway into some pagan hell. The texts are full of wild stories of blood orgies, of sadistic spirits, of the awful things these men and women would do to each other in worship of darkness. They speak at length of some substance that is meant to grant the worthy some kind of immortality in darkness. I am on patrol tonight. I need to sleep before then. But then I'm back at this. Right, okay, so I fled the rats. I haven't got long, so I need to... over here there's more law okay Noya has been telling us of the tunnel texts describing what these tunnels were used for but I didn't need him to tell me I've seen it I was in there in the dark I dream of it every night now dreams are so real that when I wake the day itself feels like a dream I'm at a ritual it begins with the drinking of a liquid sweet and thick like mucus or honey repulsive and yet intoxicating as I drink it warms my body fills me with a lust ah okay so hang on so he's dreaming that he's at a ritual. It begins with the drinking of a liquid sweet and thick. Lambert told us that we found him a drink. Do you remember? He lowered himself to me, found a trickle of spring water there and had me drink from it. It was cool and crisp with a strange sweet taste. Oh, I've now lost one note I was just reading. Shit. Shit. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, fuck. Bear with me. Here we go. Uh, so it's Toussaint Bouffoy. He's one of the ones that was locked up, I think, for the conspiracy. So yeah, I'm at a ritual. It begins with the drinking of a liquid sweet and thick, like mucus or honey, repulsive and yet intoxicating. As I drink, it warms my body, fills me with a lust for all things carnal, sex, blood, flesh. Around me are others, their faces hidden, their bodies rippling. I know we all serve the same master to the same end. A place in her unending kingdom, immortality. The things I do in these dreams... Terrible whirl of horrors, bloody and twirled, that make the charnel pit of the war seem like mere play. I wake horrified, but in the dreams I am elated. The worst part, at the end of every day, I want to be asleep. I want to go back to that place. I want to feel that way. I want the violence and the ecstasy and the pitch black darkness. Ooh, that's too good to miss, isn't it? I'll drop one of the fuels. Desk, I can, right. 
destroy this door. He looked at my soul and was like, yeah, I see you. I see you, and you know what? I'm going to fucking leave you sweat. And then he's gone. That was horrendous. My friend, after the tunnel sabotage, there are increasing security everywhere. I've been commanded to lock the door to communications. But between you and me, I'm going to keep a copy of the key in my bunk in the barracks. You never know when such a thing might come in handy. What's STD? Orty. Right, okay, I was in the barracks just now, but I didn't find the key. So I need to get back in there. That was mad. Macro. Larry Picard. Orty. Is that it there? Um. Shit, I'm gonna have to drop another fuel. Okay, communications key. Please be a save point. That'd be nice. It's not. It could be, though, if you were nice. That's not law. Um, STD Farber, I was there when they pulled your friend Neuer from the tunnels. He'd been screaming for hours before he was located. Tied to the stretcher, he was still trying to scream, but all that came out was a horrible rasp. All of the engineers have seen things down there, myself included. We should talk, you and I, about what is to be done. Let me know when. Interesting. Okay, there's more things over here. Farber is gone. Insanity. Chaos. We were here in the mess, and it burst from the shadows right behind Boas Rond. But Faber was there, ready. Practically threw himself in front of the thing. And he shot it. Hit it dead on. The thing retreated. We thought for sure it was dead, but then not ten minutes later it came back for him. I heard him screaming, being pulled into the wall, praying for salvation, and now I can't hear it moving again. Now I can hear it moving again, getting closer. Have to move now, or we'll all suffer his fate. Right, there's no power. I'm very confused as to why. I'm going to have to shoot that, and then get in there. Because it might be important. Really? Oh, hey up. Here we go. Oh 
my god! Oh my god! Where am I? Oh fuck. Oh no! I thought I was safe. Well, that's me humbled. That is me humbled. Fuck. <sighs> okay. Damn. I thought the wardrobe would do. Obviously not. Okay, let's try this again, shall we? I've spoken to no one of what's written in those texts, I swear it. But now LaRue comes out of the tunnels claiming to have seen things described in them. My rational mind cannot accept that this might be coincidence. Uh, nor can it accept the alternative. I have to tell the others what's written in these texts. Tell them. Warn them. They've punished LaRue for speaking out about what he saw, and now Reynard has sent for me. I'm sure I'm to be punished as well. We're stuck between the Germans in front of us, High Command behind us, and some other horrible force that seems to be lurking in shadows all around us. I fear we are now truly beyond God's reach. I've been locked in Delpy cells for the past two days. Reynard's punishment for me speaking about the texts. Nightmare after nightmare there, dreams of darkness, seductive darkness. Voices there, welcoming me. I returned to my bunk and was met with the men, all of whom now have tales to tell. Nikolai Faber, Hulbeck, and on and on. They're all hearing things, dreaming things. Nights are now spent in the grip of a fear that crawls up the spine and digs its claws behind the eyes, piercing mind and soul. But after what happened to LaRue and me, none dare speak to the officers, not even to Joubert. And worse, raids are beginning again. I'm going tomorrow night. Back from the raid, can't sleep. Shells falling, the soles of my boots are worn thin, my feet bloody and blistered. Lost too many out there, I feel trapped. Last night, the entire barracks was awakened by the sounds from the tunnel. Nightly, they grow louder. When I slept, I dreamt of other worlds, of pain wrapped in ecstasy. This morning, we are all as ghosts. Things cannot continue this way. I will enter the tunnels and see if I can find some way to end this for all our sakes. Okay, I forgot. Since I died, I didn't get the brick and throw it at the door to security, so I need to get that from the barracks. What are these cables here? Pull that down. Yeah, let's do that. It was over here, right? There's another flare. Can I grab that? No, okay. came last time.
can still hear him. I'm not going out. The breath. Look at the breath there. He's at that tunnel hole. Okay. So we got that. That's fine. Well, I can't say I'm 100% sure what I do now. Unless I need to just take this brick around with me and just destroy all the other doors that I couldn't get into. You know what I mean? There was some towards the entrance. Where's my inventory full now? Okay. Let me just reload me again. Okay. Why is the heartbeat noise? Yeah, he is about. Is he? Oh yeah, he's out. Okay, has he gone back in that hole? Out we come then. See, look, power is now on here. You see that? Well, that's a nice photo. Ninth of July, night. Yeah, I got another code. My conscience compels me now, as it failed to compel me then. I must do something, even if it costs me my own life. I must do something lest I never sleep again. I must do something or risk greeting hell itself as a relief. I must do something. I go. I go, he says. Do the wrench then on here.
Okay, after what happened with Neuer, after how Renard and Fournier treated him in LaRue, there's only one way forward for us. I've gathered men I can trust, propose to tell them what we will do. To a man, all of them were willing. It was such a relief. T seemed eager to go. The poor man, I hear him at night muttering in rhymes, trying to comfort himself. For his sake, for all our sakes, this nightmare must stop. Late now, on the 14th of June, the nightmares have stopped. We no longer hear those sounds. Pardon me, but now I am plagued by worse nightmares. My fellow saboteurs were all caught. Delpy and Renard torture them even now. And yet none of them have turned me in. I alone have escaped... This is Faber. Uh, I alone have escaped punishment. The honour amongst these men, my brothers. I'm not worthy of it. It haunts me. The guilt of it. I know they will be court-martialed, may even put to death, and here I am. My consolation, the war will punish me, as it punishes us all. And I will remain vigilant, lest whatever darkness lurks in those tunnels returns. This is heavy stuff, yo. The only way for, way for me to go now is this door down here. Oh, what's in here? Glare and fuel. What is down here? What was that noise? wardrobes anymore. Or should I? No, I trust the desk, right? Right, there's a lot to consider here. over there that I got to shoot as well, so this is going to be twice. Unless I can hide in there next time. Probably not. Ugh. I need a save point so bad. So bad. Like, part of me is like, do I go all the way back just to save? Still there? <laughs> Fuck's sake, what's in here? What's the point of this? Yeah, there's fuel and stuff, but still.
scared of dying now because I've come so far and there's no save point. I thought every area had a save room, but maybe I've just not got to that bit yet. Alright, what's this? Um, what the fuck's this supposed to be? Is that meant to make sense? What's that meant to mean? So that's the okay, so that's the barracks. Which mean no, that doesn't make sense. Is that the barracks? Fuck knows. That's not helped me. In the slightest. That one's pulled down, which is good news. I carry more staff. Brilliant news. Sleepless. Something keeps scratching at the walls. I've heard rats before, of course, but this is different. It's not the subtle arithmetic scratch of a rodent. It's louder, steadier. Francois has gone four times now to find the source, and each time returned with no answers, perturbed. The men like me, who were here during the Roman tunnel incident, we share skittish looks. We dare not say anything for fear of reprimand. But we don't need to say it. We're all thinking the same thing. Later. Something just howled. Not something outside the barracks, something in here with us, like before. It's like before. But the tunnels are still sealed. They're still sealed, but it wasn't enough. All my brothers court-martialed and gone, and it still wasn't enough. 16th of July, a demon from the tunnels is among us. It killed Reynard. It will kill all of us, unless... For LaRue, for Toussaint, for Noyer, for Nikolai, Ozan, and Renoir, I will kill it myself. This is why I was not caught. This is my purpose. My revolver is loaded. My will is strong. How much inventory space can I carry now, then? Nothing? It was just one. A bonus one. So what's this do? Okay. Fuck off, rat. I'm tempted to go back. save. Because I've come too... I've made too much progress, to be honest. Fuck you. Okay. Really good progress there, I think. Let's turn that off and let's feed this again. I've got ample supplies, hence I've, cause I've got an easier difficulty, but do I look like I can? This does not feel easy. We're going to go back to the locker room. Uh, we're going to go back to the locker room because I've got some more key uh, codes. This is now full. This is now full. That is the difficult thing here. Can I put stuff here? I don't think I can. <gasps> I fucking can. Right, let's... Yeah, let's go back to the place with all the lockers. Who haven't I opened yet? Lambert. Clement and Laval. Laval is own one nine one nine. Got a gas mask. 
And was it Clemont? 9244. Oh, why does my screen go wobbly then? Okay, come on, hit me. 8th of July, mid-afternoon. Oh, it's Henry. Joubert needs a scout for tonight. Routine patrol. Oh, Out to is. the communication yeah. wires and back. It'll be cloudy. Good cover. Easiest patrol possible. Sergeant wants me or Augustin to go. He still suspects one of us might have been with the mutineers. But I won't be going. How can I be so sure? Well, Augustin has agreed to a friendly game of chance to determine which of us it will be. And using an old sleight of hand trick, there's no way I'll lose. <laughs> no, Augustin doesn't have a chance because I'll ensure he doesn't. Damn, Henry. Me? A scoundrel? <laughs> Perhaps. But when he returns and I remind him of the time he pissed in my flask, or the mysterious Shit. lice that appeared in my bunk. Or the incident with that barmaid. Well, I laughed in those cases. And he'll laugh in this one. 8th of July, near midnight. Shelling again somewhere along the line. Them firing at us. I'm sure we will fire at them again soon. I hope Augustan's having a simply marvelous time. Out there. <laughs> Can't wait to tell him what I did. 9th of July. What did I do? Time unknown. It must be just before dawn. When the shelling stopped, I woke. The sudden silence always does that. Augustin's bunk is empty. I went looking for him. He wasn't in the mess, nor being seen by Dr. Jozinski, nor lurking out for a final smoke. Dax was on patrol. I asked him. He said Augustin hasn't returned from the scout. He said the words like he was pronouncing Augustin's death. As if scouts don't come running back at all hours. As if, as if it wasn't just a routine patrol. As if all hope was lost. Now the shelling is starting again. Uh, we'll try to sleep. 9th of July, morning. It has been hours now, and Augustin has not returned. His luck did not hold, and neither has mine. What could I have been thinking? If he is gone forever... But I do not want to write it, for fear writing it will make it real. I will continue to wait in my bunk until dusk. And if there is no sign of him, then... Then... Then I do not know. The priest keeps staring at me. As if he can sense I have some unseen weight on me. I will not give him the satisfaction of a confession. Oh, it was nothing. A joke. I, I thought it was just a joke. I, I never thought. I, I never thought. And therein hmm. lies my sin. Interesting. What was the pr joke that we were going to play slash did play and it did not work? There's us. There's Lambert. No. Oh. We'll check us out with a full round of ammunition. Have I used all the codes now. I have. All right. Let's get back to the main hub room. Maybe it'll circle on the map where I need to go specifically now in communications because I feel like I've explored a fair bit of it. And there seems to be power in some areas and not others. No, it's not telling me. Okay, but I think I need to destroy some part of that brick has... Oh, can I get the brick from that other room? No, can I come out of that? Have I got any fuel on me? Let me chuck one more fuel in, just because I've been thinking about. Oh no, I don't need to. It's still, still going, still going. So let me chuck that in there. Watch the gas for the protection of the lungs and eyes during a gas attack. Usage reduces peripheral vision and hearing. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Let's. It's elaborate. I understand. 
I'm going to see if the brick that I used earlier on is still there. First room that had the map. I feel like if I can destroy that, then I'll like have the map unlocked, sort of thing. Don't know if that's how it works though, because that didn't work for the prison. Maybe it's because I didn't like look, like interact with the map. We'll see. We'll see. I'm just very slow. Okay, let's go. I've saved now, so it's fine. You can't get me in this corridor. Mm, maybe you can. <laughs> Fucking hell, there's a hole right next to that door that was breaking down. Jesus Christ. And I had the heartbeat thing, so he is about awful. I got some. I can look at the evics from Ventra. Right now. Let's grab that cloth. Yeah, he's still about. He's just further down. So that's where the noise was. I didn't know if there was a table in the map room to hide under, that's why I've had to run to this one, because I know this one's here. we go. So now this sub-map has been added. So I should have done that with the prison. I should have done that with the prison. So where am I right now? I'm in the clerk's office. The dark room is where I just hid under the table. So I'm meant to be going down there. Probably the one... Wait, no, that's upstairs, yeah? I went in there. Interesting. Okay. Well, we'll go back then. Dim problem. Is there anything else about here? More spare revolver ammo now. Not more spare. Okay, patrol report. Odd occurrences last night. SDT Lambert thought dead after his patrol on the 8th returned to the barracks in fine health. He carried with him SDT Clamont. Severely wounded from an explosion, so that's us two at the beginning of the game. Lambert reports the following, that midway through his patrol on the 8th, he fell into a deep crater and was unable to escape. Clement, his close friend, snuck out after him last night, located him in the crater, and carried him out. They were spotted, and in the ensuing attack, Clement was injured by an explosion. It fell on Lambert to carry him back. Very odd that Lambert was neither injured from the fall, this is after he's been given that drink by us, mind. He wasn't injured from the fall... Oh, but that was before he drank, actually. Nor the explosion. Oh, yeah, because the drink probably healed him completely. And he ended up saving the man who came to save him. But battlefield luck is an odd thing. In every life, fate's winds blow erratic. Judging by Lambert's description, the crater he fell into seemed to have been located very close to the Roman tunnels we unearthed. It may have been a result of work down there. Recommend a future patrol, investigate, and make sure we have not opened up a back door into our own bunker. What's that? Pardon me, that's just a list of all the people's beds. Cool. I'd like to save at this point, but I'm not going to. Just tell me to go up here. Yes. 
so this just ain't working. Why? Interesting. So that's something to do. That's... Um, so what? What am I meant to do then? Um, cause I'm not sure what this map is. I meant to do something with the power. Can I follow this down? It goes in there. Right, so it's just drawn something on the map. Let me go back to the map then. What? Okay, interesting. So if we go... So where it says utility room, to the right of that, it's blocked. So we have to go through the barracks. And then turn right, and then go up, and then back around. I can do that. I can do that. It's just... The lack of save point upsets me here. Okay, okay, okay. What's that? What was that? What was that? What was that? Interesting. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So I think I'm right next to this power box. I need to turn all these switches on. Alright, so let me go back through here very quickly. Is this one on? Yes, it is. So that one is checked. So that one there is checked. I think that one's checked. It is. So two for two. I think the ones out there are checked as well, to be honest. So. I basically need to just go into here and make sure these ones are done. Ah. But this is going to be the problem. How do I get through here? I'm going to have to grenade, aren't I? Ah, oh, I'm never too late. I was too late. I was too late. I was too late. grenade it and then run away. That's the plan. Go away, will you? It's 
fine. Just need to wait for that weird background noise to go. Which it just did. Or did it? I want to go back and save, I'll be completely honest with you. So it's showing me utility room, which I'm about to break into, but then also... Oh yeah, and then go up to communication, so I think that's the last bit I need to do. Please kill the rats. Yes! Fuck the rats. Wait, what? I had access in here the whole time. I've been in here. Oh, it's that. Right. So once I've done that, I need a quick-ass way to escape, which will be in there. Okay, it's fine. Get under there! That bottle is rolling for days. I don't know if you can hear it, but it's the, the bottles on this game roll. to see if he's about, if he makes a noise. He is, I can hear him in there somewhere. Go away! Boring everyone. There's a brick there as well. I haven't even looted this room. Or is everything pretty needed? That's not needed. I'll take another few. Okay. We're in. Save point! Fucking yes! Bam! Please tell me that's all of them done. The officers have abandoned us. They ran from the beast and blew the exit closed behind them. Even Joubert. They called us cowards and traitors and worse hypocrites. Now they've doomed us. Whatever hell we suffer now it is on them. God will punish them for what they've done. Right, I've saved, so... By and large, doesn't really matter too much what happens. Well, let's try and get back to that room. Oh, the rats are back. Fantastic. I can bypass them, right?
Does this work? No. To anyone left, yes. the code is nine. Yeah. Three. Yeah. One. Yeah. Three. Yeah. I hope that you can hear me. I hope that you can forgive me. The arsenal code is nine. Three. three. One, One, three. three. Thank you, Jobert. Thank you. Nine, three, one, three? Yeah, okay. Let's just repeat himself. Let's get out of here. Back to the main room. Let's get saved. And let's get me off this game. Come on, up the fucking swans. There we go. Right. Actually, let me turn the power off. Because you've done so well, power. So well. Let's fill you up, though, for the next trip. God bless other people who are doing this on harder difficulty, where, like, the resources are probably minimal as shit. I'm loving having a plentiful inventory. Bam, bam. Okay, we have the code for the arsenal now. Now, the note said that you need dynamite, but the handle to also detonate it is in the Roman tunnels. We don't know where the Roman tunnels are. However, we are going to go to the arsenal next to get the dynamite. That'll be the next session. That will not be now. So, thanks a lot for watching. That was an intense one. Um, but, yeah, really good. My OCD is trying to get... It's making me think I need to go to the prison just to interact with the map. I might do that at the beginning of next session. But we've already done that, so why stress? Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And, uh, yeah, like if you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments how you're finding it. I appreciate the moral support. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.